Hello and welcome back to the Eternian Stories channel where today I want to try something new because I'm really behind in Project Void uh, for NaNoWriMo. So I want to try, I don't know how many of these dice I'm going to end up using, but I do have like, I don't know how to show you, um, there, kind of, yeah. I have three D20 dice here and I want to roll one to three of them depending on what number I get and write for that many minutes and see how much I can get written. Kind of like a um sprinting kind of thing um i want to do that but with dice because i have so many like i have so many dice over here and i think it would be really fun to let the dice decide how long i write for um i don't know how many times i'm gonna do it but i'm definitely gonna do it this morning to help me get more into the um writing because like i said i'm very behind i need to finish these one page character summaries so then i can go on to i'm not sure what's after that Oh, um, oh, my four-page synopsis, right, okay, so I did work on that, and I think we're just gonna get right into it, I'm gonna roll, um, I don't know how many dice I want to roll, we'll see, we'll see, and then I'll, I'll let you guys know what happens. All right, so we're gonna do 12 and 15, so almost 30 minutes. I think that'll work just fine. Okay, so in that 27 minute period, um, I have nails now, so it's really hard to do things because this is the first time in my life I've ever had nails. They look really cool though, like look how nice those are. I have girly hands now, and I got two new rings. Um, anyways, so in this 27 period, minute period I wrote 362 words and I did finish one character's um one page summary now I just need to finish the actually there's three more to do <laughs> so I'm in the middle of just sets and then I have Aiden's and then I have the voids and then I can work on my four page synopsis which I don't know if I'm gonna get to that today but I am gonna roll the dice one more time and see what we end up with and we will write for that amount of time and see how that goes. Sorry. All right, six and seven.
Peep, 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 peep. Beep, 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 beep. Okay, so in the second sprint I did for, I think it was 17 minutes? I'm sorry, it was 13 minutes. In 13 minutes, I wrote 375 words and finished one more character's um, thing. So on the first one, I finished Lena's section, and then I did Josette's, and I just finished hers in this last sprint. And I only have two left now, so I'm probably <sighs> going to work on that later today or tomorrow. But any progress is good progress, and I'm happy to have made some progress because, like I said, it's been really slow going with this uh, project and NaNoWriMo and stuff. I've been really busy with a lot of other things and really tired all the time. So I haven't really had, you know, all the time and willpower to work on this story as much as I had in um, June. In June, oh my gosh, I was obsessed with this story, but in July, I'm just kind of falling off of it a little bit, but I think I'm starting to come back to it, and I think doing, um, doing writing sprints helped a lot, and I really like the idea of using, um, my dice to help me do that. Um, I think next time I might try, like, two or three dice to see how many... Because the, the highest number you would get is an hour. So I think I would try three dice and see what kind of numbers I would get um, from that. But that's going to do it for this video. Uh, let me know down in the comments how you um, get those words in or are able to write more words um, in each session and stuff like that. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye!